Hey guys, it's Ashley from Not A Tree Reviews and I'm here with Mr. Not A Tree because we are unboxing vinyl. Um, this is a record subscription box. So this was actually a Christmas present to him because uh, he has a turntable record for all player. For her. She yeah, it's for her. State, which I love. And he's been growing his collection and I thought this was a really cool way. Um, so it it's, is a cool way. Yeah, it's $32 a month. Um, I'm going to let you tell them all about how you signed up. So, cause I yeah, didn't do it. <laughs> no. So, uh, she got me this great, uh, gift card. So I got a free month subscription and you go in and the first thing you do is, uh, connect whatever social media you use so they can actually see it. Uh, I use Spotify a lot, so that's a, a music service. Uh, and so they're able to see all the playlists I've made to get a feel for the type of music that I like. Um, and then they go through and they ask you questions about uh, records. What are some of the favorite your favorite genres? You have to pick at least three. Then they say, um, what are some of your favorite bands? And then you list the bands that you like. Then they say, um, what are some of the records you definitely don't want right. uh, in your collection? What did you say? Um, Britney Spears. <laughs> Um, I would say yes to Britney Spears. I would not. Personally, but it's not my... I, That's not yours. Not my... <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Uh, Garth Brooks and oh. Luciano Pavarotti. I didn't mm. want any of those. Okay, fair enough. Uh, right. And then, yeah, just a few more questions. And then you select a type of record set that you want to receive. So they had like five. Uh, four of them were themed around particular artists, probably sponsored by them or something like that, I'm guessing. And then, or they have a curated one, which is they look into your music preferences and then send you which, uh, records uh, if, along those lines. If you're familiar with Birchbox, that's something that Birchbox was known for is curating selections for people. It makes it very easy for them to get contributions from certain artists. Um, so anyway, the best way to go about it is, you know, your own your own stuff. Yeah, but, exactly. Um, yeah. Anyway, so this is something I will link down below to our full review or we'll go in depth with each of these. Which we won't be able to do until we listen to all three records. Yeah. Um, but we'll also, um, I'll link down below to my vinyl. I have an affiliate link I, or whatever, you know, so whatever. All right. Now, full disclosure, we have... I opened it immediately because I love it and I want to see my <laughs> records. I know, that's the disclosure. That was, you know, <laughs> why not, right? YOLO. Um, so we know what's in here. Um, to also, before we start, we've never heard of any of these bands. Like you haven't, I've never. I and we like indie music for the most part. So we're going to yeah. find out. Like this yeah. is all new to us. So I'll let you take them out and talk about them. Yeah, sure. All right. So we got this one, first one. There's also like an insert though, really quick. Amy O. Um, oh, look, you want to read it real quick? Oh, look. You... Yeah, there you go. All right. Hey, Bruce. Welcome. It had an exclamation mark. I had to yell that. I'm kicking off Bruce your like hashtag curated box with indie rockers, People Get Ready. It feels like a mashup of Vampire Weekend with Foster the People vocals. Very cool. Uh, the Next, uh, Elastic, a result of a strong desire to pump up the volume by the lo-fi indie rock singer slash songwriter Amy O. Oh, now I'm excited about this. Finally, In Rounds, a dark and melodic rock-driven folk album from Camp Dogs. The singer, Jess Price's voice, will make you melt. Enjoy, Alexandria. Uh, then some numbers. I don't, I don't know, know what that those means. Numbers are, but that's really... It's not a telephone number. So that's cool. Now, I, we, I had not seen this yet. Well, I could hear so it. Now... This is what I do. There you go. She's good. <laughs> so this is the Amy O album. This is the first one that they talked about. Yeah. Uh, which is a little more soft. Vampire Weekend. Can... Is yeah. One? No, this is the second one. This is like a... No, it's not. It's the first one. Amy O's the first one. Oh. Make me wrong. Should read it again. Vampire Oh, no, you're right. It's People Get Ready. She's right. I was wrong. That's normal in our relationship. Uh, this is the People <laughs> Get Ready album. Sorry, the, the um, soft boxes. There we go. I like the art. That's cool. Yeah, that's really cool. You know what it looks like, that's though? Awesome. It reminds me of Phoenix. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're awesome. The Phoenix album. Listomania. Yeah. And then we already showed this, but we'll show it again because this is the second one we talked about. This Amy I'm o. excited for, really. Yeah. Actually, yeah. I'm excited for this one. A uh, bluesy, like, lo-fi folk album. Also, that cool rad. album art. So, yeah. All right. So, cool. we're going to um, listen to all these. And then you, you get a free album download. We're yeah. going to listen to all these, and I'll do the full review. If you're interested in records, let me know. I yeah, think we'll be listening really cool. to it tonight. So, because yeah. we. We listen to records. We build puzzles listen and listen to, to records. records. Yeah, we're Total late. nerds. I don't care. <laughs> it's awesome. It's, it's a good cool. time. We're okay with it. <laughs> um, so anyway, uh, thanks for watching. I will uh, link down below, like I said, to the review and to uh, vinyl so you can check them out. See you next time.